In this video, I'll be showing you the easiest way to download, install, run, and use your mod manager or mod loader in Sonic Adventure 2. It's super straightforward. You just need to follow the links in the description, which should take you to this website here, which is sonicretro.org, and you can download the mod loader from here. Simply click on that, save it, and you can save it anywhere initially, um, just so save it here. Open the file up, or the file location, sorry, and then you can double click this, WinRAR is making me try and buy its stuff. In here you've got quite a list of things, um, before you start extracting, you're going to want to note where you're going to be putting it. So the easiest way to find the folder that you're going to save your stuff in, is dive into your Steam, go to your library, hit up Sonic Adventure 2, or just go into your recent games if you've been playing it on the fly recently, right click it, go to manage, and then browse local files. And it'll show you where Sonic Adventure 2 is installed, and for me it's in my local disk D, and then this will be similar to yours, Steam Library, Steam Apps, Common, Sonic Adventure 2. You have a lot less than what I've got at the moment, just pull this over here, and then pull up the folder we had zipped before, which was in our local disk that we just downloaded, and it's the Sonic Mod Loader, you can double click on that again, Fuck off. Select all of these and then simply drag that over and pop it into the same folder as the install of Sonic Adventure 2. I've already done that, so I'm just going to close this off, close that off as well, and you've got all your stuff here. Now when you open up the mod manager here, and uh, just double click it, this will pop up on your main screen, the mod screen. You can uh, click this install loader button here. Uh, once that's done, it'll change to mine, which is uninstall. Uh, you've got the names of your mods, but you probably won't have any at the moment. What you will have this now is the codes, which is shadows, bounce bracelet, disable music, infinite rings, d-pad down for mini size, right for normal size, loads of cool things that you could put in, uh, all emeralds trackable in hunter stage, which is one of the best ones to have on, so you can track the three emerald pieces that are in your stage, rather than homing in on the one each time, which is just so much cleaner to have on. To download extra mods for your Sonic 2 mod manager, just go into the second link in the description, which is this, um, I'm not even going to try and pronounce that. It's main memories page, and you've got the item box randomizer, Dreamcast costumes, you've got the holiday mod, uh, supersonic mod, super shadow mod, and physics swap mod, which lets you use other characters' physics and put them into a separate character, which is super good for Eggman and Tails when their movements like a bit clunky. You can swap them for someone else, uh, and kind of zoom through your levels, I suppose, if you want to. Once you have decided which one you want to download, for the sake of it, we'll just choose Dreamcast models, and we'll save this to wherever you want. Again, doesn't really matter where you save it to. Go into here, or whatever mod you download, uh, go into your downloads, click on Osho, the containing folder, and then you'll have your mod here. Uh, there it is, the DC Costumes one. Double click on that, and you'll get your DC Costumes folder here. And now the folder that we just had open two seconds ago, the Sonic Adventure 2 one, that you installed your mod manager in, you want to go in this folder called Mods, and then you want to drag in the folder from your WinRAR, right into that folder down in there, right? Now obviously I'm going to put this in and it's going to tell me it already exists, so we're just going to skip these for me, and let that basically do nothing. Pull that over here, close that out, and then we're going to boot up Sonic with a couple of mods on. Let's just put on All Emeralds Trackable, Chow Stat Multiplier, and we'll leave that off. We'll keep the music on, you can have all upgrades. Let's just do Size Modifier, We'll do D-pad down to shrink, D-pad up to grow, low time, max score, infinite rings, player one, and have a magnetic barrier and invincibility. Then we'll go into the mods, and for the sake of it, we'll enable our Dreamcast costumes. We'll save this. Don't save and play from here. It's much easier, especially if you're using a controller on Steam, just to go back into Steam. You can do that, just minus that out. Go into your big picture mode. Let this load up for a second, and play your Sonic Adventure 2. So 
Sweet, and once your Sonic finally loads, Final just jump into whatever save you're really looking to do. I don't really want to mod this save, but we're not really doing too much in your ring count while we set, and obviously it won't count to your rings if you don't finish a stage, which we won't be doing. Just jump into whatever level you want. We did have a couple of weird mods installed, so we'll go into Sonic City Escape. Always. And then we've got our different costumes on as well, which is kinda cool. Kinda cool. We can get bigger. Hit this ramp real quick. Oh, <laughs> sick dude. Yeah, that was amazing. But you get the kind of drift, and even even in the pause menu, your character changes size. We'll dive in as Knuckles onto Aquatic Mine and just see what's going on here as well. Amazing, and Knuckles outfit looks pretty damn sick as well. And as you can see, the three emblem lights are blinking, which is really cool. You can track your emblems a lot easier. But yeah, exit the game and you've got all these different mods that you can play around with. Uh, you see you've got different things like you've got the Chow key, always have it, so every mission you'll finish you go to the Chow Garden, you can get Chow stat mods. Loads of different things, so use it to your heart's content, enjoy it. I do think Steam achievements are still enabled, so you can go and get them all if you really need to. And other than that, enjoy. Enjoy your modded Sonic suit.